Hi, back here DIY again. This is Erica. Um, so we usually cover stuff outside. Today we're covering an issue inside because my dryer stopped working. <laughs> I threw a load in, I closed the door, nothing happens. So I was like, well, you know, maybe I'm not just not doing something right. It's, the door isn't, you know, registering that it's closed. I'm not sure. So I kept playing with it and come to find out it was actually this part. As you can see, it's a little thing that registers when the door opens and closes. It's supposed to click. Well, mine just lay there. <laughs> Didn't do anything. So it was never registering that I closed the door, so it never let me start the dryer. Which is also really bad because it also never registered that I opened the door so I could open it while it was going and it wouldn't stop. So, if I was lucky enough to get it going. So we got a new part. We had to track it down. It was like $26, I think. But we got it, so we are replacing it now. And this, just to undo it, you just pull it towards you. You gotta take this out first, sorry. And then you pull it towards you and lift off. Which was already undone because we didn't bother recording, take it out or anything like that. So, um, if I can get in there, can you? Put it in right. Backwards. Oh, that's too big. So it does have to go that way. Okay. So you can see it like peeking through. And then we just gotta put the screws back in there. You can let it down. There's two different sizes. Alright, so we gotta put the screws in there. Get them started. So get the other one put in here, and then we'll tighten it down, start putting it back together, and hopefully it works. <laughs> Hell if I was putting it in the right hole. Okay, as tight as I can get it. Bye. Get my handy dandy screwdriver. Such an awkward angle. Everything always comes out easier. <laughs> okay. Alright. She's back in there. So now we just have to hook up the wiring, which is just this little piggy tail. Just have to make sure that little point matches up. Clip it in. Does the light come on? Boy, I thought that thing was burnt out months ago. <laughs> ah! I think it works. <laughs> That's so exciting. Okay, so since we didn't show taking it apart, kind of explain putting it back together. So it'll just be in reverse, of course. <laughs> so to put it back on, I just need to pull it towards me now. And then 
drop it down. And it, if you just push a little bit, and I really didn't have too much, it kind of clipped in where it needs to go. So, and there's two more screws here in your lint tray thing. And that should be it. Okay, those are back in good. Put our lint catcher back in. <laughs> Obstacle course in there. All right. Moment of truth. Is this gonna work or not? I'm afraid to push the button. Ready? It works. It works. <laughs> It stops when I open it. The light works. I so thought that was so long ago burnt out. I totally lost home of it. I didn't even know where the bulb was. I gave up. It smells weird now. Ew. Anyways, so that's how you fix it. Ours happens to be a Whirlpool Imperial Series dryer. It's like an extra large capacity. Very, very nice. This is the first problem we've ever had with it. And we've had it, I think, eight years now. First problem ever. And of course, we bought the five-year warranty and never used it. But what do you do? So that's it. We fixed it. What? Oh. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Um, watch us repair something. We're always trying to do something. We're always looking for new ideas. So if you have anything you want to see, if we don't have it, we can probably get access to it and show you pretty much anything within reason, uh, of course. So if you comment, let us know, or let us know what we should never do again, anything. Just comments, good or bad, are still helpful either way. So let us know what you like. Like this, subscribe to our channel. We're trying to post videos pretty often. Um, Sometimes we just don't have a lot at hand or we're working on several different projects so we're videoing here, here, here and sometimes it takes a while to actually get them once we get them done but either way, we're here. Let us know what you want. We are excited to hear from you. Thanks for watching.